about five years ago, I was presented with the opportunity to move over to player development, helping these young men transition into the program, have a great time here, and then obviously transitioning out of the program into the real world. Basically anything outside of football or academics, she's involved in. All of the social life stuff, the community service uh, events, she's the one getting the players to those, making sure they're participating in them. I think community service you know, plays a huge role. I think one, because you look at you know, the local community, and these are the same people that are at your games, that are supporting you, that are proud of you. They do a lot of our service with young students, whether it's little kids from two, three years old, you know, up through middle school. They idolize these players. This is who they want to be. So whether it's sitting with you know preschool class and reading them a story, that's fun for them. And it's an opportunity where, you know, one, they're building a resume and getting these great experiences, but they're also, you know, giving back. When you come in as a freshman, you're not, you know, really thinking about doing community service and things like that for other people. But as you do some of those developmental things, it really kind of opens your mind up to helping other people and seeing how important that is. A huge part of her job is dealing with the player's social media accounts. As much as you try to teach and educate the guys about how to treat that stuff, how to handle it, what to say on there, it's still every day checking in on those accounts to make sure they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. And anything that does come up out of the ordinary, she jumps right on it to make sure it's taken care of. I've had a, a couple of serious conversations with her talking about how she cares about our well-being, how she cares about what we put out to the media and um, how we carry ourselves. So she, she really cares about us as people, not just players. She's one of those people that actually cares about you and wants you to be successful. A student athlete journey is so much bigger than they even know. But for me, the college experience is, it's, yes, it's football, yes, it's winning games, yes, it's winning championships, and yes, it's getting a college degree that you're extremely proud of. But so much of it is all the other stuff that comes with it. It's the adversity, it's the dealing with the time management, it's learning things about yourself. It's being pushed athletically and academically so much further than they ever even imagined that they could push. And coming out on the other side as a man. And before they know it, they realize, oh my goodness, I am ready to get into the real world. And then they come back, you know, six weeks, six months later and say all these life lessons, you know, keeping well-groomed and, and keeping a low haircut and being 15 minutes early for everything and shaking my professor's hands and looking him in the eyes. All of these life lessons are little things that we, we kind of ingrain in them when they're 17 years old, that by the time they're 22, 23, it's natural and they're so much more prepared for the rest of their lives. <music>